is undermining what we're gonna say. Adam's not on a strict diet anymore, so we are celebrating time. We're gonna make there's these cinnamon buns that look so uber delicious that I've literally wanted to make for maybe like five months, and tonight is the night. On our way to the grocery shop. We're on our way to Whole Foods. Adam had another accent lesson today. On our way to Los Angeles. We're on our way to Sainsbury's, and we're gonna get all the ingredients for the cinnamon buns. We're on our way to be in the hollywood sign you are so american it's insane but oh yolk you put them in <laughs> vanilla extract hi guys welcome to what do we call this cooking show two men is better than one what the fuck? <laughs> oh i didn't mean that look at the other hand in the trailer Looks like our penis. Our penis is a <laughs> sentence I never thought I'd hear. Um, we're gonna make cinnamon rolls now. Okay. So there's a lot coming to terms with the fact that we're now have to live the rest of our life like this. <laughs> first things first, make the dough in a large bowl. Oh, <laughs> oh my god, I'm left-handed. One and a third cups of flour. Check. Yeast. Check. <clears throat> Rip it. You can't leave yeast on the floor again. Oh. That's so dangerous. Awesome. Sugar. How many grams of this? Uh, uh, it was, oh, two tablespoons. Okay, salt. It's over there. Add in the warm dairy-free milk. You have to warm it up. I don't want to warm it up. Let's get warming. That's warm. Yeah. These better be worth it. Butter. They have to melt the butter. So beautiful, they. So now bite it and then spit it in the pan. You do it. <laughs> Should I dare me? I don't dare, dare me. I do dare you. <laughs> yeah. No way, that's so no, it. Come on, do it, do it, do it. <laughs> Okay, let's go heat this up. Let's hop back and do the rest while we wait. Okay, we're getting pretty good at this. I know, right? Baby, you can't go to sleep. No, I'm not going to sleep. I'm being you, be my eyes and ears. Okay, hold this straight. Yeah, yeah. And in. In. Four. Now we just need the butter. Let's go check on it. Oh, that's melted. Go, go, go. I need to hold this pan. But I don't know anything else. Yeah, I know, but I don't really know what to do about that. <laughs> oh, we can do it with our hands now. Yeah, my nose is issue. No issue with your hand. Nice, babe. Not trust you with your left hand. Okay, now we cover the bowl and allow the dough to rest in the bowl in a warm area until about double in size for 20 to 30 minutes. See you in 30 minutes. <laughs> We're back. Okay. Wait, where's the dough? Oh yeah, I moved the dough. Oh. Let's see if she rose. Love it. Yes, a little bit. Okay, you may go now. I will call you when it's done. Right, love you, babe. Oh, comment down below if if you if you. Oh. It's okay, babe. Come back. Later. Comment down below if your uncle picks fruit. It's just you and me. I like to slice the dough into individual strips before rolling, but you can also just roll the dough and slice it into four cinnamon rolls with either floss or a knife. To roll them into strips, slice the dough in half. So have two strips of three times fifteen. Then slice them into half again so you have four strips of 1.5 times 15. Then roll each strip tightly. Bro, I'm just gonna wing this. Okay, last but not least, let's make the topping. I heavily apologize for all the camera switching. Why does it look like this? Wow. One minute twenty left on the timer. Are these supposed to be hard? Babe, they're done. I'm nervous. I know, I don't know how they're gonna taste. Okay. 
bit too hard but the taste is oh my god as <laughs> good as it wait don't go away with them no 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 that's how good is that oh my god <laughs> wow this is the first time this I've had in like three months two months I hope you enjoyed our cooking show I'll put the recipe in the description okay love you lots bye let's go again why are you sad are you sad because we don't have any love for you today anymore <laughs> Let's figure out how to play happy birthday to you. Listen, listen, listen. That one, that one, that one. We don't need to know it. Adam's making us rice. <laughs> Basmati rice, give you a fat bati rice. Yeah, okay, Adam and I learned a dance. <laughs> I just wanted to show them the dance we learned last night. Oh, and you know the one we learned last night? No, yeah, with you. We, it was important enough. The day with the eyes closed. Okay? Okay. We got a new sculpture, guys. <laughs> you can kind of see the face. Yeah, this sculpture gets sent to us by Ramirez Preconto. It's a new artist from Barcelona. Nice guy. He is actually a really sound guy. He reached out to us and he was like, hey guys, I got this for you if you want it. And we said, yeah. That was a bit of gentrification. <laughs> Babe! Oh my god! I'm on my way to Shores because we're gonna have a sleepover. Tomorrow we're gonna go charity shopping, which I'm so excited for. I feel like I've been in such a style rut and I think I'm finally starting to remember what I like. My closet just doesn't add up to what I like, so I'm excited to just find some cheap things that are really cute. We'll take you along tomorrow. Anyway, I'm in London because Adam's in Oslo and I don't like being in the house alone, so I'm here. <laughs> uh, we're gonna go find some face masks. The shop closes in 20, 20 minutes. minutes. Well, we You're still open That's for a yeah. moment, right? Five minutes. Yeah, okay. So. This is so cute. Uh, Thank you. I don't want to go back in the rain. Don't move to England if you're thinking about it. It's not oh. worth it. Oh. Wait, I'm going <laughs> Adam's in Oslo. Something happened. <laughs> Something happened. <laughs> Why are you in bed so early? I want you to be wrong. Tranquility. Clarity. What about community? <laughs> I want immunity, please. I want to tell you something. If you put an animal on right now. <laughs> Bye, Adam. Bye. Oh, yours is black. Mine's so why we're switching it. Oh, please. hey. <laughs> oh. <laughs> anyway, we're gonna answer some questions. Oh, when did you start shaving? I think I was about 12. However, my thingy, I didn't start shaving until I was like maybe 17. 17, yeah. There was just no need. Oh, oh. Fuck. What do I do if my crush ghosts me for several days but also gives me signals when we meet? Well, you know what you do? You need to ghost him too. You need to play as hard as you can, babe. Play the game, seriously. See you tomorrow. Um, bye guys! Love! Good morning! Good We're going morning. for breakfast. Slept like little angel. Put a little headband on. I've never done this before, like since I was 12. But I like it. So cute. That's a great eat, eat, eat. I found some fun things. Let's try them on. What is that? I don't know. I'm just gonna get it. The absolute no. That was success at the first shop. I think the charity shop gods are blessing us. Oh. Wow, Shar. They're so good. Look what I just found. Oh my god. Love you, Mom. 
Bye, vloggy. Bye. I'm gonna have some lunch at Otolengi. There's one thing that I didn't show you in the shops. I was walking out and then I saw it in the cabinet and I was like, that is the most gorgeous thing I've ever seen. Can you see it? You will understand, okay? Hold on, you're gonna scream. Well, you might not scream. I will scream. Oh, wow. Look at the zip here. What? Burr. Say hello. <laughs> What were you gonna ask me? Baby. I said only on me. What's on the menu? I wanna ask a serious question. We can't have this one. Okay, I have a question for Adam. What would your death row meal be? Stew. <laughs> <laughs> I would have five Dixie chicken wings and one more Lee's burger. I would have French toast with bacon and maple syrup from bread ahead. Seaweed salad. In and out burger, Coca Cola, like that has been open for a while, so it's not that busy. You literally just asked me this question so you could answer it yourself. Yeah. I'm gonna ask Adam some of the questions that you guys asked Shara and I. Um, what is something you want to achieve this year? I would like to go to the seaside. If you could give me and Shar a new name, what would it be? Shar would be called Binky, and you would be called more gloth what do i do if my crush ghosts me for several days but also gives me signals when we meet what signals is he giving you <laughs> I don't think that's the one. if he's giving you those signals the answer is king kong okay well, i need the toilet where you hold it i need to pee as well can i go first the face like that i'm gonna say no <laughs> there has been an infinite price paid for you from the second that your existence became there was already a price paid for you and then you're adding on top of that the things that you value so just by existing and the fact that you exist in the first place means that you're valuable the chance of you existing is so slim much like my face when i was young i used to get bullied Someone said your YouTube videos are my Stairmaster videos. Hey, Evie. Climb, 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 climb. Evie also said, I just love you, Ivana, so much. Like, I genuinely smile and get so happy when I welcome you. Then Evie also asked, favorite sex position. <laughs> Evie, what the hell? It was going so well. Evie! <laughs> what did Stairmaster do to you? Evie, we've never even had sex, guys. <laughs> yeah. What the fuck? I like the one, you know the one where, uh, you uh, do the one with your uh, where the boobs is facing. And... <laughs> you know that one where, cause like, just the one that this. That is my f just my number one hundred favorite. Just to, cause that's all guys, either like this one. <laughs> that one that's all guys favorite because even when i go to the gym and i go into the locker room at the gym oh what's up andy did you get, get some of the um that sex last night did you get some of that sex last night and then they all they all say stuff like oh where is your carer Okay, we're actually gonna answer them properly now. <laughs> laugh all you want. Laugh it off. Go laugh it off. Okay, take four. Adam will behave now. Adam's funny juice has now been drained. I'm 19 and I feel like I haven't lived my teen years. There's nothing stopping anyone from just packing their things and just going and getting on a train and just going and exploring life. Like yeah, you're actually allowed to like do stuff that's not just like normal. For the plot. For the plot. For the plot. Yeah, just start living for the plot a little. Not in like a way. By live for the plot, we mean do things that you, you'll be proud of in the future. For the plot doesn't mean like go and get fucking a ratchet. Favorite way to eat potatoes? Mashed potatoes. Mash. I'm 16 and never even had my first kiss and I don't know what to do. I went first kiss at 19. Adam was my first kiss ever. That's not true. Oh, no, that's not true. Some idiot Spanish boy on the beach. 
let everything unfold at the pace that it wants to unfold at. What do you do when you feel like you're not really close with your best friends anymore? Do you think you just let it go away? It's happened to me a couple of times. Like, you're so different from who you were like three years ago. The chances of you changing in the same way that your best friend changes are quite slim. And know? that's okay. And don't worry about it. Like, going, going it alone for a little bit is okay as well. Advice you'd give teenagers about life in general? Be a sponge. Mm. Ask questions. Just I wish I'd done that more. Understand the importance of, of trying. It's not cool to not try. By the way, take all these advices with a pinch of salt. We're just also figuring it out. If you wake up and you're breathing air, you're already doing better than so many other people who have existed before you. There's no long paper. We're almost at Shar because we're helping her move. Mm. Oh. Alright, luckily I have a big oh. car, otherwise it wouldn't fit. to film my handstand because I said I would do it last minute. Yeah. Guys, this is my talks and dreams here. I don't do this. I don't love you. No! Oh yeah, that would help. Oh. <laughs> I give up, I hate this fucking thing. I'm going to bed. <laughs> no, you're not. We've got a giveaway. The winner to announce. Hi guys! It is time to pick the giveaway winner! Dun, 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 dun. I was actually surprised that people even entered this giveaway in all honesty. We got a lot of poems and we're gonna go through them. Babe, come on now. He's trying again. Because you've not been like, motivating me. Okay, baby, come on, you got this. Do it for our love. I love you so much. You're so handsome, so big, so strong, and it's so fire that you can do this stuff. Yes, come on, come on, come on, come on. Push, push, push. Like I was saying, we are going to go through all the poems from the giveaway. Let me take the stage. Welcome, bubble, bubble, bop. You bought a bike from the tub. I might fall while learning the unicycle. I'm yearning. How do you go about turning this new skill? that I'm earning. Your newest sub, Bubbles Bubble Bob. That was fire. <laughs> Welcome. In a quaint little town, Adam and Ivana rode. On a unicycle, their love brightly glowed. Balancing love on a single wheel spin, their laughter echoed a joyous thing. With a start and a gasp, <gasps> Adam's face turned pale. For the unicycle wobbled and he lost his trail. In a moment of panic, he gripped, faltered tight. And at last, dear Adam met an unfortunate plight. Amidst the chaos, a mishap ensued. And Adam, well, he shat his pants, quite crude. Yet Ivana with love didn't miss a beat. She laughed and she smiled, their love still sweet. That's a pretty fire one. Ivana, the stars at night are nice. But you, my love, taste like pie, sweet and shiny. The moon is bright. I love you forever, sleep tight. Adam, Adam, Adam! Oh, oh, Adam! Don't forget to eat the soles of your cats. Their bean feet need rest after touching grass. <laughs> Sophie, it's awful, but it's so bad that it's good. I love it. <laughs> okay, guys. Some solid attempts, then. Wow. Wow. Whoa. Whoa, fire. Oh my god, a lion. Ah! <laughs> Another lion. One more lion. <laughs> it's between you, Emily Schrader. Naima and Sophie Dale. And Sophie Dale. Okay, on three, two, one, we say our favourite, which should eliminate at least one person. Three, two, one, Sophie Double. Dale. It's uh, a bit unfair that we're not picking that one, but we just like really stupid stuff. <laughs> I feel like we should send her something because her poem is really good. Naima, DM Ivana. Yeah, please. And, and we will send you something. We'll send you something because that was too funny. Like three almonds or something. Something better than that. Four almonds. <laughs> should we do rock, paper, scissors on, on Sophie and blah, blah, blah? That's the only fair way to do this. If I win, Emily wins. If Adam wins, Sophie wins. <laughs> Now we've got to figure out what to actually send you, Sophie. A one-wheeler, four iced teas. Run around the house, find four other things, and we'll meet back here. <laughs> My first thing that I want to give to Sophie is... Oh, because look how cute it is! Coconut rice. All this jewellery is bangles, rings, necklaces, all from one of the best brands, Pilgrim. 
How to train your dog like a Navy SEAL. You can use it on any animal, hamsters, fish, anything, little siblings. Is Mark Jacobs Daisy perfume? Chanel Edinburgh perfume because I'm from Edinburgh. These sunglasses, model them for me please. Oh! This game that you can play at the beach. And of course, wheel it in. <laughs> the unicycle! You will also get four lifted ice. I'm gonna message you right now actually. Hi Sophie, this is Savannah. That was freaking fire and you win the giveaway. Can you just send us your address? I promise we won't do anything weird with it. <laughs> and if you send us a video of you riding it, we'll send you a hundred pounds as well. Bye! You may have probably feel like you're gonna do something weird with our time. I swear I won't. <laughs> okay, also, little side note, very soon we're going to film a video where my broadcast channel on Instagram decides our whole week. It's going to be extreme, like we're going to be putting a couple countries in a poll and then you get to pick which country you go to, then activities, then food, then we're gonna go accommodation, all everything. So join the channel. The more of you there are, the more fun it is to make the video. Join and here, join here, join here. Join, join here. Join here. We love you lots and thanks for watching the video. And see you next Sunday. See you next Sunday.